having a pretty relaxed Saturday. I've done a little laundry, uh, a little tidying and such, but just been hanging out with my girls as my husband went to go pick up a corner cabinet for our fixer-upper. Um, that will have to have an update pretty soon for you guys in a video. My 450 square foot little cottage that's next door that we're gonna have as, as an Airbnb, if you didn't know that. Um, so that is where he is. We'll be back in about an hour. It's already almost 11. Um, so we're gonna make some cookies here because it's a little cooler today, finally, after a giant heat wave that went through. And so just been having a nicer, slower Saturday morning. So we're gonna do an outing this afternoon and then go to a little party for a newborn adoption later. So I'm just bringing you with me today. before pulling some weeds. The Creeping Jenny is inevitable this year. It is very bad and it is taking over everything, probably because it's a very hardy weed that is enjoying this dry weather. All right, so it's after lunchtime. I have Nevaeh down for a nap and our youngest is fed, Nadia. Um, and so I'm gonna cut some broccoli because it's starting to bolt and I probably need to pick a few more beans and I might do a second planting of my beets right now because I really wanna get that in too so I can have a fall harvest of that. But aren't my flowers right here just beautiful back there? The yellow is some tansy. I'm loving that right now. bad of a harvest. I picked the rest of my beets. I already have pickled my bigger ones already. And then my broccoli. I found a tomato on my husband's aquaponics system. A few cucumbers and then I picked some beans. So I plan to plant some more um, beets right there next to my beans here. We are at our first store. If you're in the local area, it's Elio Home. They have 50% off pillows, so we're gonna check them out. Yeah. Oh, this one's cute. Yeah. 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 Ooh. Blaze, these would look good. Oh, really? Nice. These would look good in our little house on the gray couch. Who's this? It's a fun one. This would be cute for fall.
blanket. Daddy. Daddy. You want to go up by dad? Yeah. It's cute. Alright, so we are back from our shopping excursion and um, thrifting. So at that Elio Home Store, I picked up this stuff here. This pillow was $5. I thought it would be really cute on our bed. I love that detailing. Um, it's got like little plush balls on it there. Super cute. And then you saw me pick this one up. Um, this was $10. But isn't that a great pattern for fall it's got those earthy tones and kind of like a little it's almost pinky orange color and it's um almost flannel feeling so super cute pillow there and then these ones oh my goodness the texture on these is incredible and they're so fluffy i thought this would be really good in our little fixer upper uh cottage because i have a gray couch and then like a blue accent chair so if i don't use them there it would go well in my home too because i use a lot of blues as you can tell i'm kind of going with the blue theme this was um originally 20 and then so 50 percent off would be 10 but she gave it to me for five dollars so i really thought that was a cute rug and it would look well i think in front of the kitchen in our little fixture upper or honestly in my own home again too because i use a lot of blues so it was a really fun shopping trip and um yeah if you're local definitely check her out so we are going to enjoy the evening with a fire. The girls are down for bed. Nadia will feed in a little less than an hour, so that will be coming up soon. Nivea is just talking herself to sleep. And I hope you enjoyed coming along today and seeing what I got at Elio Home. Um, also, I just am excited to get the fixer up together and all these little touches are fun to find. But anyways, I'm gonna enjoy a little snack and some tea when I go out to have some fire time. 